Hey guys, let's make a quick and easy snack. We're gonna go ahead and make pepperoni and cheese mini muffins here, you guys. Make sure you have some kind of biscuit dough. I don't have exactly regular flaky biscuit dough. I have my crescent roll-ups, which they can work too, you guys. We're just gonna shred them up a little bit. Some string cheese. I have the Paw Patrol string cheese. You could use whatever kind you want. I just have the plain mozzarella. You could use the Colby mix, whatever your favorite kind of string cheese is. And then some pepperoni. So first thing you're gonna do is wash out your pan and go ahead and grease this. All right, I went ahead and greased my little mini muffin pan with a little bit of olive oil. Now the next step you're gonna do is open up your dough, take a little piece of it and kind of tuck it in each little muffin hole here. So here's a closer up look of what I mean. I went ahead and I just have a little piece of my dough here. You guys, you're gonna tuck it in and make sure that the biscuit dough kind of surrounds the outside and then we're gonna put our filling in and then we'll tuck that in as well. All right, so I took three pepperonis, sliced them in half, kind of crisscrossed them like that. And now I'm gonna go ahead and take my string cheese and cut a chunk off and put that right on top. Okay, so it should look like that. Now you're gonna go ahead and take your corners of your dough and just kind of tuck that in and make sure it's covered. It should look like that when you're finished. It kind of looks like a little um, wonton per se, like a little crescent. And then push that into your little mini muffin pan and then continue to fill all your holes here. All right, so this is what it'll look like when they're all folded and put in the tray, you guys. I have enough to make two trays of these. I'm gonna go ahead and pop these in the oven at 375 for about eight to 10 minutes, depending on how big you make these. It will take a little bit longer, so just kinda keep checking. You want it to get a little brown and make sure that the inside is fully cooked. Let's go ahead and put these in the oven. Freshly out of the oven, and this is what they look like. They puffed up absolutely perfect some bigger than others and that is okay we have the little mini ones here but you guys look at the cheese coming on out i don't know about you guys but i actually like um when the cheese has a little bit of the um darker corners the crunchy cheese that's like perfect all right you guys let's go ahead and pull these on out All right, let's go ahead and open one up here, you guys. Ooh, still super hot. Look at the stretchy cheese. Perfect. You guys give me a like and subscribe. Make sure you watch some of my other videos. I have a ton of cool new recipes on there, you guys. The last thing I'm going to do with this is I'm just going to scoop out a little bit of marinara sauce and dip this right in, just like a little pizza bite. Thanks for watching, you guys.